This is a true story, um, but a, um, an event that occurred just outside of Guadalajara, Mexico. My father-in-law has a ranch down there. Um, it's out in the mountains, sort of in the middle, middle of nowhere, just outside a little village um, called La Soledad, where about 15 people live. And uh, we were driving up to the ranch one evening, about four o'clock, and uh, a Chevrolet, very modern sort of Chevrolet truck pulled around the corner at a very high speed, and this was a little, this was a little uh, ch sort of one lane road that really wasn't even one lane wide, and uh, we thought, well, surely he'll slow down when he comes up to us, and we'll work out a way to pass each other. But no, he was in a, in a great hurry to get out of there, and. Uh, um, we we went up we went up to the ranch and started asking around to discover what the, what happened and why this guy was uh, fleeing so um, so rapidly and and uh, discovered that um, there was a wedding going on the next day in this village and uh, as is a custom down there the day before the wedding the the bridegroom will go up um, with his uh, party of men. And they'll they'll choose one of the one of the bulls from the um, from the flock. I don't think you call it the flock. <laughs> <laughs> what do you call it? The herd. Thank you. <laughs> I grew up around sheep. <laughs> and um, they'll choose one of the one of the herd, and the, probably the best one, and they'll 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 sacrifice it and they'll kill it for the wedding feast. And um, at, uh, at the very same time. This strange happening had occurred in the village where the, this man came out of nowhere and shot a young man um, with a with a gun through the middle of the hand, and uh, so so nobody knew where this guy had come from. And and the next day, the police, the Mexican police, came out to to kind of get to the bottom of it all. And as as what uh, usually happens in in uh, Mexico is that it's not really about finding out. Who did it? But they just need to pin somebody, and uh, they ended up uh, finding the groom with his man cleaning up in in the in the river with blood on their hands, and and uh, they decided to take the groom off to to imprison. So that's where the story came from. <laughs> Yesterday makes good time Nobody knows why We saw the shooter fly Late model Chevrolet Through the dust of a dying day the fear of God dripping from his hands like the blood dripping in Nick's good time. They held him up, down in Nick's good time. But the blood of a bull ain't the blood of a man. From the color of the steam Color of the steam Blood from their hands, the wedding's gonna. 